When I was at Home Depot the other day, I actually noticed a uh, end cap that used to be rigid like for many, many years. It was Milwaukee M12, Makita, then rigid. I was notified last week that rigid actually lost their end cap and was replaced with Ryobi. So rigid is gone though. This end cap is no longer rigid. So please leave it in the comments below if your rigid end cap is also gone. I'm not saying rigid is no longer being sold in Home Depot. I'm just saying that their very important end cap was taken over by right Ryobi. I do know that TTI is a part of Rigid as well. So let's explore the Ryobi end cap and see what is actually in this that replaced Rigid. As you can see right here, they have a good assortment of oscillating attachments, a couple of kits for ranging from 50 to 30 bucks. They have a 3 8 inch socket adapter, including with sockets. It's really, when it comes to Rigid, it's not that much more than Milwaukee. Like, it, like if you might as well get Milwaukee if you want to get rigid. It's the the prices of tools used to be cheaper, but they're actually a lot more expensive than they were years ago. So now it's like you might as well just get uh, just get the next step up because it's just a few dollars less. They have all the HP tools on display. You know these compact tools are actually nice. They're a good size. I wish the base was different. I wish that Ryobi did change their battery for a, a, a slide clip in. So I was surprised to see this because Ridge is supposed to be up there with Milwaukee. You know if the the brand the brand in between Ryobi and Milwaukee, but for some reason they got rid of the end cap. I was seriously surprised on that. I have not tested this yet, the uh, cutoff tool. I still need to pick that up. I did try the M12. It is nice to see more green because I do love the Ryobi black and green now. Like these tools are actually pretty good. I do like the new Ryobi stuff. Back when I first started the channel, the Ryobi stuff was decent, but not, now their tools are actually pretty, pretty good. I was just surprised to see on the rigid stuff actually gone. You know, like rigid still is at Home Depot, but obviously that that very important displayed end cap is gone because now the only way to see uh, the rigid display is to actually go down the aisle, go down the tool aisle instead of going down the main walkway. And I'm not sure what's happening with the rigid. Is rigid doing bad, and they seriously need to pull their uh, their main displays for that to put the product on there that's actually doing pretty good in which the I bet the Ryobi stuff is just Selling left and right, but I was just surprised to see that and so please leave it in the comments below If you guys notice that your rigid display is gone as well like the main display When it comes to not having to be in the tool section and so yeah I was just surprised to see that and we'll see what happens in the future when it comes to the rigid product line and I'm not sure, but we'll see. We will see. So that's pretty much it, guys. I just want to let you guys know this. So if you found this video helpful and entertaining, please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.